Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of my latest build on City Skylines. My name is Peacock and thanks for joining in. Before we get started, uh, I want to invite you to hit the like button on this video and any of my videos if you feel that this is informative and entertaining. Also, if you want to follow along in this series, feel free to subscribe as I plan to release frequent videos. And please turn on notifications so that you know when I post the next video. Having said that, let's get into it. So in the last video, we um, started to build out our uh, our terminal over here. So we have our, our uh, harbor for our uh, incoming tourists and new residents. And we also set up the uh, train terminal for our inbound uh, tourists and new residents. So we've linked up here to the main to the main line. And we, and we define this sort of main road here that comes into the highway here and then have this other main artery that comes down and meets up with it again here. So then we can take this and kind of come down here to the uh, entertainment tourist area. And then we also have another possibility to do another avenue down here through the university over here and the downtown area over here. So since the last video, I did a couple of things to kind of clean things up. Um, I moved the waste uh, waste holding facilities that were over here. Um, and I went ahead and I, I added them down, uh, down here in the district. And uh, since I uh, installed the, I think it's, I think it's pronounced jelly the the district manager to where you keep the services in the district so I took these and put them actually in the district so now these two are dedicated to this district um, the other thing I didn't do was I didn't incorporate the park as part of the district and so I went ahead and I did that as well um, but the main thing I did was over here on the industry side I got rid of all the trees that were over here, but then I kind of cleaned up things a little bit. I took the uh, the main line. Do you remember it came it came all the way over here and down, and then it came sort of like up this way, and then sort of it was it was sort of diagonal. It wasn't parallel to what we we're trying to do here on the pier. So I went ahead and and. Uh, went ahead and did that, made it parallel to the pier. And then I ran the um, uh, train line uh, from here uh, through here, under, under here to this new uh, cargo terminal that I've, that I've put in over here. So it, makes, it links up with this, comes back out on this side, and then into this uh, T junction with the main line, so um, so it, you know the trains can go in either direction and come in from either direction. And then I've also I moved the services that were over here um, to this uh, section here, and uh, including the waste transfer uh, waste holding facility. And and then I went ahead and I districted this whole area so that the services stay within this area. So um, eventually, you know, we want to take this and expand this to do other other industries. So we have our fishing uh, that we that we have over here and then ways to export all of those goods. So um, and then, like I said, I, I kind of fixed the main line to where rather than having that bridge come across and, and come out this way, thought about just riding it along this way since we we now have coverage on this side to deal with fishing with this terminal over here but as we start doing other industries um, thinking you know either having another probably having another terminal over here to handle the stuff that's on this side and another uh, exit uh, on 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 this main uh, the main artery here and then I put the, uh, the rather than doing an overpass changed it up a little bit and just 
did one that was that was sort of underground. So now now we're caught up. So now in this new episode six, um, I want to go ahead and expand on this, create a new uh, residential. Do, we'll do a high density residential area, and start getting uh, see if we can get above that uh, ten thousand mark. And uh, so let's let's start with that. All right, so I've gone ahead and I built out the residential area and um, basically created two new districts. And uh, like I said, this is going to be all high, high density uh, residential and commercial. So to set that up, um, did a couple of things. One, I went ahead and I moved this and kind of centered it along this road. And I added a um, train terminal for uh, importing goods to to support um, the commercial uh, businesses that are going to be uh, popping up here. It was kind of neat because it actually is wider than or deeper than the uh, passenger terminal. So it fit nicely. I just added it next to it. And then brought the line in and it's good to go so the uh, the game plan is because this is going to be high density uh, we have to make sure that uh, we don't bottleneck ourselves with traffic and try and set this up in a way so that uh, traffic can can flow freely as much as possible so basically what I've done is the main uh, paths through here are one ways so you have two entry points you have one entry point over here and another entry point over here and then this is actually an exit point um, so you come in you have one lane and basically it comes in and, and makes three but this main thoroughfare like I said is is one way so it comes up com or comes down over and up and over and then all the way down and up and over and it just keeps doing this so it's three lanes until it reaches here uh, once you do the last uh, uh, suburb you know once you do the last street so then you come down and you have two lanes here and this side here is basically a mirror of this side but you have now two lanes here. You have two lanes coming off the highway. And you have two lanes coming from here. So I've added, this is a six lane one way uh, road. And there are only pathways. We don't have any, we don't have any roads until we get to here. And basically this will allow people to kind of loop around if they need to get back over here or back over here and also the commercial area I'm thinking is going to be right here along with our services um, so we'll have our services up here and I may move commercial uh, to along the edge I haven't uh, thought about that yet I'm gonna leave the edges un uh, unzoned so if we later need to move this to kind of clear up some traffic, we can do that. So, but basically, it's six, like I said, this is a six lane uh, road. So then we have two going left, two going straight, and two going right. And then this ends up being, this is a one lane road with parking on both sides. So we have uh, parking available for our commercial and I may, and I'll go ahead and probably create some additional parking lots on both of these sides to kind of help with uh, with parking. So, and so basically we we uh, split out from six lanes down to two into this roundabout. So, um, so I've done that. I I, I did that off camera because it this actually I knew it was going to take me a while. So I uh, probably spent about an hour uh, making sure that everything was kind of lined up right and, and uh, 
you know, and, and so forth. So I, I did that off camera. I haven't zoned anything yet. It's still unzoned. Um, but we'll, what I want to do now is go ahead and set up our, um, our mass transit. I want to set up our metro specifically. Um, so let's, let's look at, let's see, metro. First, let's look at where, where we should probably have the stops. We'll probably, we'll, we'll definitely need one here at the, at the cruise port. We'll definitely need one here at the passenger terminal. Um, we may need one, um, uh, kind of thinking, uh, so it'll probably be here if we run along if we run along the road it'll be here and then have some sort of bridge pedestrian bridge to cross over come down through here maybe right here where this where this uh, node sticks out and then same thing over here have another stop maybe right here and then in our um, original neighborhood uh, having stops along this main road um, and then up here this this part and then maybe probably right here where the school is have another have another uh, set of tracks going through there and then doing a loop basically to circle all this and join that up with this line and then having another line basically come out from here kind of set this up so that we can as we grow you know, we can kind of split off this way and have Metro going this way. And having another line come through here, from here, over here to the uh, um, uh, industry area, having a connection over here. Maybe we have another one over here as we as we build this area out. Uh, but for now, let's, let's set up this line uh, in this section and then I also want to bring another line through here because eventually the campus is going to be right here. So if we can break it off at some point and and have another uh, line come through the, the southern part and then basically feed right into the campus, I think it would be perfect. So let's go ahead and uh, set up these uh, these metros. So we have a line going to, or our tracks going to industry, have tracks going from there 
through there to school, through there to this area, um, from there down through here to school, to this Belmont Park area. Let's see that side is covered. And then another loop out, or exit out. Okay, so I think we've got it. So let's go ahead and let's set up some lot, some uh, routes. All right, let's do one here. We'll go along this line all the way down to industry. Just go straight down to industry. And yeah, now we'll come back. And this will be the um, cruise harbor. Okay, so that one's done. Let's do one that circles around here. So this is the is that one. Oh, we should probably include the school. So let's add a stop here. Okay, so that covers that. And then Let's do one from here. Yep. Create a new line to here. probably need a loop for this guy too so let's do a let's do a loop here as well um, probably need to get yeah I think if we if we bring tracks over here connect to this that way they have access to the park so let's Okay. 
Okay. So then let's add another line. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Let's go here, here, here. This one. And this is the girl square. Fair view heights. Oh, unlimited. Okay, that's fine. We'll just call it Pearl Square Loop. So our lines. All right, Cruise Harbor Industry, Pearl Square Loop, Belmont Park Industry, and Belmont Park Loop. Okay, that's good. Okay, so now I'm going to. Um, run this and see how we do. So right now we're still, we're good on our numbers. So let's add, let's start with residential. Let's see, so four. back there we go and we want that one okay so then let's get these done go down as far as we can. Okay, and then let's not ever forget water. I'm 
you coming, dude? So they should be all watered up oh, up here. Yeah, that takes care of them. So how are we doing on water? Okay, we're good there. Good on sewage. Power, we're still good. Garbage. Let's go take a look at our processing plant. is high. Oh. Let me go ahead and just put a district over here too. And then uh, we need... It's funny you need police even though you have a prison. Fire, a small fire, medical, put a clinic, and then a crematorium. Okay, that should take care of them. Okay, so pollution. Pretty good. Traffic, 82%. Let's see where our hot spots are. Okay, so we got some warm spots over here. Probably over here at the port. Yeah. Yeah, eventually when we get back over here, we'll, we'll have to address this. Let's take a look at... Oh, yeah, look at all the people. A ton of people down here. Oh, and over here at the school. Perfect. Look at all those people. Right now, we're up to 146 a week. Unemployment is at 13%. Okay. How are our land values doing? So we're getting high over here, I guess, because of the school. High, obviously, because of the park. Interesting high because of the harbor. Okay. So it looks good. All right, so let's... Oh, education. Let's look at that. Uh, we're good on this side. We're going to need to add some on the other side. Uh, we're, we may need to add a school over there too, and then eventually we got to get the university. So that'll probably be on the next episode. We'll tackle the tackle the university. Um. Okay, so let's speed this up a little bit. See if we can get to nine thousand here by the end of the by the end of this episode. Oh, we're going the wrong way. All right, people, where are you? That one's got thirty-three. I didn't have him 
much at all. Okay, so I do think we need to. I think we we are um, possibly the, the the next episode will maybe either do the campus or we'll come back to industry and add some more add some more fishing to it. So I think this is a good spot to end this episode. I appreciate you tuning in, and if you're getting value from this video or the series in general, please hit the like button and consider subscribing to follow along in our journey of this exciting build. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next episode.